So in today's video, I'll show you exactly how to reduce the file size of JPEGs and PNG images. Reducing your image file size is extremely important and it helps from things like reducing email attachment size all the way to making your websites load way faster. I'll show you guys two different tools that I personally use. They're completely 100% free. And yeah, the process is super, super simple. Okay, so the first site that I've been using for forever is tinypng.com. This is exactly the same as its sister site, tinyjpeg.com. And yeah, we'll have both of these links down below in the description. So when you go to the main website, this is all you're going to need right here. There's two different ways to do this. You can either click on this and you'll be able to choose the file like that. Or you can simply just open up the folder right here, find the image and then drag it here. So you can see originally this is 2.45 megabytes. It's going to work on compressing this image. And while this does not change the actual dimensions of the photo, it will greatly reduce the actual file size. So you guys can see it changed from 2.4 megabytes to 395.1 kilobytes, which is an 83 percent reduction in size. After that, you'll be able to click download and that's going to download that photo. You guys can also drag multiple images into here. It's going to batch process them and you'll be able to click this download all to simply download them all with one click of a button. If you want to make the image even smaller, what I recommend doing first is reduce the image resolution. You guys can do that on Microsoft Paint, Adobe Photoshop, Lightroom, Mac Preview, and there are even other platforms like this online that can do that for you. That way you'll start off with a smaller resolution, then you can plug it into to tinypng.com and that's going to make it even smaller. Here's another website that you guys can use, compressedjpeg.com. Again, pretty much the same exact thing as tinypng. You just drag the files right here. Don't click on this because that's an ad. And after it's done processing, you can see it reduced it by 64% and we can click download all. So yeah, super, super simple. That's all you need to do to reduce your image file sizes. And yeah, hope this video was helpful. Make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe for more content just like this. This whole channel is dedicated to helping you build your business. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video.